I'm Sophia Vialba, your community reporter in Morro Bay, where one person is dead after flames broke out at a home here on Kings Avenue early this morning. It's shocking, plain and simple, just to think that could be me. The Morro Bay Fire Department, as well as other fire agencies, responded to a house on Kings Avenue around 1220 Saturday morning. Crews made an attack on the fire and during the firefighting operations did identify uh, one deceased individual. The identification is still um, pending. They've been there for a long time. They are uh, Amazing neighbors always have been good people. Maury Garza heard a loud boom followed by another noise and went outside to go check on what it was. He saw nothing and as he headed back inside, he saw a glowing reflection of a fire on his house window. By the time the fire trucks arrived, the flames were really big and you kept hearing uh, noises like something might have been exploding. Garza lives across the street from where the fire broke out and moved his car so they would not get damaged. And also to provide a little room for the emergency vehicles that I knew were going to be coming up here. Garza is glad the fire didn't spread. If there were, had been wind and no fog, it could have been devastating because we have a state park directly behind us loaded full of uh, unburned fuels, lots of dry grass. Garza, who has known the residents of the house for several years since he's lived on that street for decades, says it's heartbreaking to see a tragic loss. You know, when you grow up in a neighborhood and you get to know everybody, and especially people who are uh, pretty close to you, especially good people like that, uh, you, your heart goes out to them. It's, it's, it's a tragedy. The cause of the fire is still under investigation by the Morro Bay Fire Department and the San Luis Obispo Fire Investigation Strike Team. In Morro Bay, Sofia Vialba, KSBY News.